Well, many of you continue to reach out to our spectacular <laughs> Dr. Malachar Marshall with your coronavirus questions. And, of course, tonight the doctor is in, so let's get right to the first question. Dr. Darlene writes to us, my adult daughter had mild COVID, then had emergency back surgery. She had to get the vaccine to keep her job against her surgeon's recommendation. How will it interfere with her fertility, and how sick is she likely to get from the shot with compromised immunity? A lot to unpack there. Yeah, I know. Um, but first of all, I don't think you should should worry. The vaccine will not affect her reproductive system or her ability to have children. And if she has a compromised immune system, she's actually less likely to develop side effects from the vaccine. Side effects really develop as the body mounts an immune response to the vaccine. And she's much more likely mm. to get sick if she got reinfected with the coronavirus. People who've had COVID are still advised to get vaccinated within 90 days of their infection. So she should be fine. All right. right. Good news there. Cheryl says, as I got the booster and several days later developed a hoarse voice. My husband's boss had COVID a week ago. My husband tested negative, but should I be tested for COVID or could my laryngitis be from the vaccine? So I think yes and yes. yes I mean, and I, yes. I think you <laughs> may, if you may have been exposed to COVID through your husband or otherwise, you should get tested. You can buy a rapid antigen test mm -hmm. at the drugstore and test yourself at home, or you can go and get a PCR test. It's certainly possible that your symptoms are related to the booster, in which case they should go away soon. But if you're concerned, get tested so you can have some peace of mind. Have you heard of that people laryngitis after a booster? I haven't heard about that very much, but I bet it can happen. Awesome. All awesome. right. David Milford writes, I received received my flu shot in September, my Pfizer COVID booster two days ago. How long until I gain full effectiveness of the Pfizer vaccine and will the flu shot interfere with that? I think that's a good question. A lot of people getting boosters now, they want to know when that really kicks in. Right. So get your boosters and your flu shots if you're eligible. And it generally takes about two to three weeks to build full immunity after any vaccine to especially the COVID vaccine or the flu vaccine. And no, the flu vaccine should not interfere with your ability to mount a robust immune response to the COVID-19 vaccine. As you know, young children often receive several vaccinations during their pediatrician's appointments without any concern that one is going to interfere with the other. Your immune system can multitask. Really? Yes. Wow, that's pretty good. So I didn't can I. know. My, maybe my immune system can't. Who knows? <laughs> and I'm sure it can. Doctor, thank you so much. Yeah. As always, Dr. Malika offers her best advice. But as always, consult your personal doctor before making any decisions about your health. If you have a question for Dr. Malika, three ways to reach her. Her email, drmalika at cbs.com. On Twitter, her handle is at Malika Marshall. Or you can Facebook message her, Dr. Malika Marshall. Lisa. All right, David.